warning, this game has jump scares and other scary stuff and is based on FNAF and Roblox. Ugh, excuse me, sorry. What is going on, you guys? It is Andrew Roboto here, and welcome to Five Nights of Roblox, where, like I said in the beginning of this video, this is a game based off of FNAF and Roblox, which I love playing both FNAF games and Roblox. Um, it's I, I played that game a lot as a kid and a teenager, and I still do this day. It's a, day, it's a really good platform, so I highly recommend you check it out and play it. It's got a lot of really good games on there. But anyways, before I start this video, I will give an update. Um... Uh, regarding the coronavirus, my school has once again extended their closing date this time to the rest of the semester, so that means it will not be open again until September, so that means I'll be making videos here until I go back to college in September. But um, but for now, I'm, uh, I'm kind of uploading less videos, for those who don't know, it's because I have to do online courses and homework, so I will upload as much as I can, I'm not sure, but we'll see at this point. I will upload some. I do have some more videos planned for Easter weekend, and then I've, and then I will upload more videos when um my semester ends in May. But anyways, without further ado, we'll start a new game. News. We got a news article. Roblox's toys and box factory is closed because they got offensive and attacked children's night guard needed. Okay, that's the most weirdest news article I've ever read in a FNAF game or fan game. And we got a moving screw in the middle. Alright, so we have two vents to close, and then there's this thing in the table which says Bloxy. Um, let me know in the comments what Bloxy is, because I don't remember seeing that in any Roblox game I played. Alright, so we have three guys on the stage. I don't know who we're dealing with this night. And there's a Roblox face in a window. And I'm checking the cameras right now. I actually played this game for... I actually did a demo of this off-camera to see how to... If that guy becomes active. And as you can tell, he just moved. The the yellow Roblox guy, he will come out of that square... That big rectangular picture. And you have to close the left door before he arrives. Because you only have little time to react. So we have a foxy in this game. And then, um... And then we're dealing with one of the Roblox characters on the stage this night. And then we have an exposure meter, which means you have to close the vent to avoid getting exposed. Reminds me of Finance of Tubulin 2 because of the because we had to protect ourselves from Po 2.0. Alright, so we have two Roblox characters active this night. And I'll see how it should be interesting. The battery meter is interesting because, um, like, it only shows two bars of battery. It does not show, like, it doesn't have, like, three, four, or five, like, most FNAF games. Oh, gotta shut the door. Alright, he's gonna be coming out of the picture soon, so I gotta close the left vent, or door, I don't know what it's called. It's actually a door, which is, it's small because the Roblox characters are tiny. So that's why. So we gotta close that door, and we will let him go through. Or, not let him go through, we will let him come at the left door. So the yellow one and the red one will be at my door. I'm checking my camera to see when it'll move because he just burst out of the picture. See that? You heard him. He just ran. Alright, so we got a foxy we're dealing with this night. Okay, he's back in the picture. Good. Alright, perfect. Because he was a little confusing to deal with, but I figured it out. Oh, and that Roblox that is active goes back to the stage. Okay. So I'm checking the camera pretty frequently because this guy is going to come out of the picture any minute. And the exposure meter went up a little bit. So at least we have a sound cue in this game in front of a Roblox guy comes in because we hear a sound. And then for the yellow, for the one coming out of the picture, he'll just run to the door. But the interesting part is that he doesn't bang on the door like Foxy does. 
Cause Fox. Oh, gotta close the door. All right, he's gonna be coming out of that frame soon. Oh, there's another yellow guy. Oh, and the other two guys just moved. Okay. All right, so we're dealing with three characters tonight, so I gotta check the right door as well, as well as the left. Gotta close the left because he's coming, and I will check the right right now. Ah! Okay, got rid of him. The good thing is the Roblox characters will leave when he closes the door right away. Like, they don't stay there for a couple minutes. That's actually a good thing. And I have the left door closed because this guy is going to be coming out soon. And then this, and then the guy in the middle, he's not active this night. Oh, I just, I thought I heard running. Here, I'll put on the camera because I need to check the right door. Okay, he just ran. Okay, he's back there. Now I can open the door again. Okay, I just got rid of a guy. Alright, good. Sorry, I was having a drink, but I just got rid of that guy. Ah! Okay, close that. Open back up again. And I gotta check for this guy. In fact, I actually I actually do not have to check the cameras much this night. Like, I only have to check for this yellow guy and then put it down. And then I just can just manually check the doors. And exposure meter's half full. They'll show you right there. I don't look at both doors, see who's coming. Cause we can actually see through there. We don't have to shine a light on there, so that's a good thing. Ah! Okay, a guy just came and he didn't show up. Oh god! What is this on your face? Catch up? <laughs> good way to die, okay. <laughs> Except it's blood, and there's me after I died. It shows the news article again? Jesus, that's weird. <sighs> Alright, so we'll try again, because I just got jump scared by so much confusion. So I'm going to have to close both the doors pretty much when, like, they, like, one doesn't show up or not. At the same time, so that's what I'm going to have to do for this night. Alright, he's starting to slowly pop his way out. Like Foxy does in Pirate's Cove. Like, he slowly makes his way out. Okay. I mean, I don't really need to check camera as much. I might need you the next night because the black Roblox guy is not active this night. And I don't know if he'll be a threat on night... I don't know if he'll be active on night two. We'll see in the next night. Right now, I'm trying this night again because I just got killed at 5 a.m. I mean, I was doing so well until I got jump scared. Like, the weirdest part was, like, you didn't see that Roblox guy. Right when I put down the camera. I'm also checking the stage to see who left. Okay, one just left. So I don't really need to check the cameras much, of course. I'm only checking just the... Ah! Gotta close that door. And I'm gonna close the door again, because he's gonna be coming. Alright, so really I only need to check the, the stage camera and the hiding area, the cove area. And then this guy off to the right, he will move, he will move later in the night. And he's running.
yellow guy's running. The yellow guy. Ah! And once again, I was having a drink. Sorry, I couldn't talk right. All right. So I dealt with him already. <sighs> he just came to the door. Okay. So I'm definitely gonna be checking that camera, of course, pretty frequently. Alright. And it actually gives the players a sound for when they arrive and you have a certain time to react. Alright. Has he fully came out yet? No, because right now he starts off as a head in like a giant mirror. And then he slow, and then he comes out as a as a role, full Roblox form. Anyone else move? Okay, so now we got two that left. Okay, so two of them left the stage now. Which of course I got to check both the left and the right. Okay, I gotta close the left door because he's coming. And I just had to close the other door because the purple guy came. Right, so I'm not gonna check the camera because he'll be coming. Okay. I'm gonna check the stage camera though just to see who's there. Okay, two of them are there. And I have the left door closed because the other one's gonna be running soon. Running for his money. <laughs> How many guys are on stage? Let me check the camera. Oh, it's just one. Okay. He just bolted. Okay, good. Now I gotta start checking both doors. Pretty frequently. Okay. Camera up, camera down. Okay. And I got... Probably God knows how many times to react. Okay, alright, got rid of him. Perfect. I don't know how many of these guys we're going to be dealing with this night. Alright, I'm checking the stage camera. Ah! Left door closed. Alright, I should really not be checking the camera. And the exposure meter is about to get full. I better close both these doors just to be... I'm going to close both the doors just to be safe because... Because if that exposure meter gets full, then I die. So I'm just going to close both the doors to be safe. Plus, I mean, it's 5 a.m., so I'll be able to beat the night no matter what. Because, I mean, we have plenty of power left, so I can just keep it closed right now. And I do not have to check the camera right now. Alright. I just don't want to get that exposure meter full. That's why I have both doors closed, because I don't want to die again, because I just died early in the video. We beat night one. Ooh, that we got Legos for for the night beating. Woohoo! That's pretty good music. I'll be dancing off to this music right now because that's pretty good. Okay, so we will take on night two in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment, subscribe. I appreciate all your support, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.